Gabe, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good. Where are we? We are in Graffiti Alley. What does this place mean to you? Energy, vibrancy, kind of a city scene. We're a little bit hidden, but a bit of a gem. How would you describe yourself in, in three words? Uh, bald, loyal, and easygoing. What would you say your greatest strength is? Uh, I don't take decisions too quickly. I, I think things through. And your greatest weakness? Ooh. Sometimes I don't take decisions quickly. I think things through. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell us a bit about your research? Yeah, so uh, I do policy work related to cities, part of the reason why we're here. Uh, so I'm the director of the Urban Policy Lab at the Monk School. Um, and a lot of my personal research along those lines has to do with how the cities around us are governed, uh, which levels of governments are involved in that governance, who makes decisions, when, what kind of decisions, and how can we make those decisions better. Why is right now an essential time to be studying public policy? It's always an essential time to be studying public policy. Uh, it doesn't matter whether we're in the middle of pandemic or otherwise. Decision making is crucial and our students are going to go off into the world and help make those decisions. So it doesn't matter what time it is, now is the time to be at the Monk School. What advice do you have for students taking the program? Uh, to take initiative. Uh, and most importantly, don't worry too much about your grades. Uh, this is another adjustment in the grad school experience. It's not about what's happening in the classroom. You're not shooting for the next grade. I would say that this, for most of our students, is the last degree that you'll be taking. So make sure you get the best and most out of it by learning from your peers rather than trying to shoot for grades. What was the best gift you ever received? Ice cream maker. But I don't use it to make ice cream, I use it to make slushies. Favorite flavor of slushy? Orange. Who's your favorite Canadian? Chris Hadfield. Your favorite novel? I don't have one, but I'm reading a great book right now uh, by Joseph Boyden called The Arenda. Your favorite TV show? Veep. Favorite art form? Art form. Let's go with street art. Favorite sport? Hockey. How do you think people would communicate in a perfect world? Uh, did you get that? Thanks, Gabe. This has been great. And uh, it looks like there's a thunderstorm coming, so uh, we'll let you get out of here. But before you go, any parting advice? Uh, you're right. It's really going to come down. Uh, really, I would say to all the students, take advantage of all the program has to offer, all the school has to offer, the university. But most importantly, I'd say take advantage of your city and all it has to offer for you, whether you're here in Toronto or studying from home online. Make sure that you get out there, bring those experiences into the classroom. You'll have such a great time discussing in class and making sure that we understand everything that's going on in your life and bringing that to the policy world. Thanks a lot. See you awesome. soon. Awesome. Thanks, Gabe. Mike safe. Thanks.